It's time for today's Bulldog Conversation, presented by the Sanford Sports Network. I'm sitting with Michael Morgan, assistant to the president here at Sanford University. It's great to be sitting with you. We are talking about the March of Dimes Walk for Babies in Birmingham event, which kicks off tonight. Talk a little bit about exactly what this event is and what how Sanford's gotten plugged into it. Sure. Tonight we had more than 100 team captains from the Birmingham metro area okay. who will each be leading their businesses and organizations to mobilize their employees and, and friends to come out and, and join the walk on April 24th. There will also be a lot of family teams. These are families who've been touched by premature birth okay. and that is the mission for the March of Dimes. So we had a great kickoff tonight. Everyone's really excited about the, the walk for babies. Coach Sullivan was the MC for the event, and he did a great job. He's, he's just a fantastic uh, person and is very interested in, in the March of Dimes and has been for many years. We got involved last year with the March of Dimes when uh, the folks there contacted President Westmoreland okay. and invited him to be the chairman for the Birmingham Walk for Babies. Okay. And of course, he readily agreed because the mission of March of Dimes to prevent premature birth is so important. Do you realize that one in six births in Alabama is a premature birth? I did. More than 10,000 children in Alabama were born premature last mm. year. Some of these children are so small, Nathan, that their father's wedding rings can actually be worn as bracelets. And those infants are surviving thanks wow. to the work of the March of Dimes. But we have so much more to do. With all the advances in technology, we don't know what causes premature birth. And when a premature birth occurs, those children can spend weeks and even months in a NICU unit with, with the cost to the, to the families and to mm -hmm. society course. as a whole in, in the thousands and thousands of dollars. It, actually, the impact on, on the American economy was more than $20 billion last year as a result of premature birth. So we really need to work together on this program. And obviously, uh, President Westmoreland, when he was invited to get involved mm -hmm. with the March of Dimes, said yes because the health of our children are really the future. And it sounds like a great program. How was Sanford's involvement last year? Was that successful? Talk about a little bit last year's experience. Oh, it was great. We had more than 20 teams show up last year from Sanford University. There were more than 300 individuals who came out oh, wow. and participated in the walk. We raised more than $20,000 from Sanford as a part of that event and uh, reached out to the community and involved so many more people. We were actually uh, named the organization of the year because we involved so many walkers wow. in the event. A great uh, competition broke out uh, at Sanford between the athletics department and the School of Nursing and Different they were each <laughs> racing to see who was going to raise the most money for this cause and uh, we had a great time. I, I remember on walk day, the, uh, the folks from Publix provide the food okay. for the walk and uh, when the Sanford football team showed up in mass with all those guys headed over for the food table, you could see the folks from public saying, we're going to need more food. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. It was a lot of fun. Well, talk a little bit about how this organization, the March of Dimes, fits in with Sanford's overall mission. Sanford adopted a strategic plan a couple of years ago, and one of the strategic priorities in that plan is to engage the global community okay. in learning, faith, and service. Okay. And Every week, more than uh, Sanford students are involved in more than 100 mission and ministry outreach opportunities. And the March of Dimes is such a worthy organization that just fits right in and it able, enables us to involve the entire campus. But we know from uh, surveying our campus that more than 80 community organizations are involved in uh, and supported by Sanford students and employees. Wow. And so we're, we're known for our community service and involvement and uh, have really enjoyed our affiliation with the March of Dimes and, and in meeting other people from the community in, in a shared mission. Now, as we said, tonight is the kickoff event. Well, how about the actual event itself? When is the event going to take place? The event is April Saturday, April 24th. Okay. And it's going to be down at the UAB Mini Park in downtown Birmingham. Okay. And uh, if people want to get involved, they can go to marchforbabies.org. There's a way there that uh, our, our listeners and viewers tonight can form their own teams and uh, reach out, walk the neighborhood. That's how March of Dimes started, going out with a can and walking the neighborhood and raising the money and, and come out and walk with us on, on April 24th. Should be a great event come April 24th. And thank you for... Uh, you actually answered my next question. It was going to be how can people learn more about getting involved with this? Do they have to be 
if they want to participate with Sanford, do they have to be a part of the Sanford community, or how does how does that work anyone, for participating? Anyone and everyone can join a Sanford team. We call ourselves the Sanford Nation, and uh, and actually there are lots of teams within teams. I okay. mentioned the athletic department. Mm -hmm. uh, they'll have one athletic department team, but then they're competing with among all of the uh, various 17 athletic sports. Okay. <laughs> and each, <laughs> each team is competing against, against the other, other teams. And, uh, and it's going to be a race between the nursing school and, and athletics again, you I'm pretty sure. You think so? Who won out last year? The nursing school the nursing did. School. Athletics okay. was leading uh, in the last hours as we were counting the money, and the nursing called and said, who's ahead? And I told them by how much, and they said, we're going to raise some more money. <laughs> Ray, raise the bar a little bit. Well, great, a little friendly competition for a great Absolutely. cause. Absolutely. That's all the time we actually have for today, but it was great to sit down with you and talk about the March of Dimes. Birmingham Walk for Babies. Again, I'm sitting with Michael Morgan, assistant to the president at Stanford University. Thank you. Thank you. You've been listening to Bulldog Conversation with Nathan Troost. The Adventure Bus Charters Halftime Show continues in a moment. This is the Sanford Sports Network.